and Crystal Tavern in marriage. The Bible teaches that marriage is to be a permanent relationship of one man and one woman, freely and totally committed to each other as companions for life. Our Lord declared that man shall leave his father and mother and unite with his wife in the building of a home. And the two shall become one flesh. Ecclesiastes chapter 4 says, There was a man all alone. He had neither son nor brother. There was no end to his toil, yet his eyes were not content with his wealth. For whom am I toiling, he asked, and why am I depriving myself of enjoyment? This too is meaningless, a miserable business, because two are better than one. Because they have a good return for their labor. If either of them falls down, one can help the other up. But pity anyone who falls and has no one to help them up. Also, if two lie down together, they will keep warm. But how can one keep warm alone? Though one may be overpowered, two can defend themselves. A cord of three strands is not quickly broken. Amen. Amen. Who gives this bride to be married? Amen. The home is built upon love, which virtue is best portrayed in the 13th chapter of Paul's letter to the first Corinthians, to the first letter to the Corinthians. Love is patient and kind. Love is not jealous or boastful. It is not arrogant or rude. Love does not insist on its own way. It is not irritable or resentful. It does not rejoice in wrong, but rejoices in the right. Love bears all things, believes all things, hopes all things, endures all things. Love never ends. So faith, hope, love abide. These three, but the greatest of these is love. Marriage is a companionship which involves a mutual commitment and responsibility. You will share a life in the responsibilities and the joys of life. When companions share a sorrow, the sorrow is had. When companions uh, share a joy, the, show, the joy is double. You are exhorted to dedicate your home to your creator. Take his word, the Bible, for your God. Give all devotion to his church, thus uniting the mutual strength of these two most important institutions. Living your lives as willing servants, and true happiness will be your temporal and eternal reward. Let us pray. Almost gracious Heavenly Father, we thank you for our time in today's service, Father God. We thank you for the commitment of marriage, Father God. We thank you for instituting marriage, Father God, and for smiling on marriage, Father God. We thank you right now for Crystal and for Clarence, Father God, to watch over them and touch them and keep them, Father God, as they go through this ceremony, Father God, and together. Father, we thank you right now for the oneness of marriage, Father God. We pray that you just fill them with love, fill them with joy, Father God. Watch over them and keep them. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. 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 Now to the vows. Clarence, will you take Crystal to be your wife? Will you commit yourself to her happiness? her self fulfillment as a person, to her usefulness in God's kingdom? And will you promise to love, honor, trust, and serve her in sickness and in health, in adversity and prosperity, and to be true and loyal to her, so long as you both shall live? Amen. Amen. Crystal, will you take Clarence to be your husband? Will you commit yourself to his happiness and his self-fulfillment as a person, to his usefulness in God's kingdom, and do you promise to love, honor, trust, and serve him in sickness and in health, in adversity and prosperity, and to be true and loyal to him, so long as you both shall live. Amen. The rings. <laughs> Clarence, as you 
place the ring on Crystal's finger. Please repeat after me. Say, on this day, I married my best friend. The one who shares my life, my love, and my dreams. I give you this ring as a symbol of my love and devotion. I offer you my heart, my hand, and my love. I join my life with yours to cherish and protect you as my wife. With all that I am, with all that I have, I honor you as my wife forevermore. Amen. Crystal, as you place the ring on Clarence's finger, please repeat after me. On this day, I married my best friend, the one who shares my life, my love, and my dreams. I give you this ring as a symbol of my love and devotion. I offer you my heart, my hand, and my love. I join my life with yours 